How is it going guys and welcome back to a brand new video today I'm going to be teaching you guys the loyalty glitch for cheap fast and reliable foot coins Check out u7buy.com There is a link in the description and use the code Haber to get yourself a discount on all of your orders This glitch gets you loyalty really quickly and it doesn't affect your record Which is one of the best parts about it I'm going to teach you how to do it on PlayStation and then we're going straight over to the Xbox where I'll teach you guys that are on Xbox how to do it as well Sadly, I don't know how to do it on PC. I'm sure you guys can find a tutorial out there somewhere but I'll show you guys for both of the consoles now for this we're going to focus on Kean Murphy who I've just bought for 200 coins he's played zero games in the club obviously has no loyalty uh, everyone else in this team has loyalty but you want to focus on this now in order to get loyalty you either need to pack pull a player or they need to play 10 games for your club they get a little green badge next to them like uh, my man Millen here has um, and they get an extra chemistry and essentially they're incredibly important for SBCs specifically the advanced SBCs for example hybrid leagues hybrid nations hybrid leagues and nations they help you complete the really difficult SBCs in that category um, so it's actually really important to get loads on certain players and I'm going to teach you how to do it really quickly without affecting your record and give you 10 losses on the record now obviously I think the quickest way you can possibly do this is just by rage quitting 10 games if you really want to but in my opinion it's not worth ruining the record for it so without further ado let's jump into it like i said murphy has zero games played i'm not going to cut this so you guys know obviously i don't know why you wouldn't know it's real but um it's really easy you want to go over to play and go into squad battles now what i will say is um this could affect one of your games if you have uh if you grind squad battles sorry i know i said i wouldn't cut but like we're still on the squad screen anyway you want to go over and either play uh your hardest opponent uses but it really does not matter you're not actually going to play the game we're going to play uh dest's squad here i believe you could play the uh squad as many times as you want and i think the highest point one is the one that counts if i'm not mistaken um anyway Anyway, jump into a game as you would a normal squad battles game um, with the player you want to get uh, loyalty. Maybe it's the entire team um, and just go into a game as you normally would. This is really easy um, and it should only take you around 25, 30 seconds to get loyalty. Uh, sorry, to get a, a game towards loyalty on the players. Uh, like I said, you're just going to go into it like a normal game. Dest has built a pretty nice squad here. I'm glad I'm not actually playing it with, uh, with the bronze team. Um, and when they kick off, it's really important. Wait for them to kick off. Press your PlayStation home button in go over to your settings go down to network untick connect to the internet tick it again and go back into fifa now you'll get this message that you've lost connection to the ea servers and it will take you to the home screen as it's doing right now for me it will take you to the home screen leaving ultimate team now previously people used to quit the application and load it back in again you don't have to wait the two or three or four minutes it takes to load the whole application up again. You just get put to the home screen and you're straight back into Ultimate Team. And as soon as you log back in, you've actually got loyalty. Oh, sorry, you've got an extra game towards loyalty. It doesn't get you instant loyalty, but you get an extra game towards loyalty and you don't get a loss in your record. I'll show you guys Murphy again to prove that he's got one game on there uh, towards loyalty. If you do this 10 times for loyalty, I would guess it'd only cost you, uh, it'd probably not cost you, but it'd probably take you like, I don't know, eight to 10 minutes maybe at uh, max. Um, and as you see, Murphy has got one game played and I didn't get a loss on my record. Really easy. I'm gonna hop over to Xbox now and show you guys how to do it on Xbox. Now over to the Xbox, I'm gonna show you guys how to do it on Xbox. It's incredibly similar. Uh, it just takes a little bit of something different. So uh, Jonathan David has played four games. He has 56 goals and 19 assists. Obviously that's because uh, I went for the 100 finesse shots on this account, but he's played four games as you'll see, and I have zero losses on the record. Once again, you're going into your squad, uh, sorry, into your division rivals. No, wait, into squad battles yeah I, was, I said this i said the right thing first all right and by the way if this is helpful to you guys please make sure to leave a like on the video i'd greatly appreciate it hop in on beginner and go into your game of squad battles as you normally would um if this was a team obviously i wanted to get loyalty on then i go and do this but it's just the team i'm running the road to glory anyway um but yeah i'll, sh I'll show you guys I had four gains on him before and i had zero losses on the record so hop into your game of squad battles as you do Wow, that team looks incredibly similar to the team we just played. That is absolutely mental. Uh, but we just have to wait now until we get into the game. Uh, you can use both bumpers to skip the entire intro. Wait for them to kick off. Once it's kicked off, press the Xbox home button and go over to your settings. Go into network settings. And it's literally pretty much the same sort of thing. You literally want to click go offline. It'll get take a few seconds. Click go online again. 
you're back online, um, and it will basically have the exact same effect as it did on the PlayStation. So you go over to FIFA 21 on the Xbox One, you're going to press A, and it's going to take you all the way to the main menu once again, where you're going to be waiting to get back into Ultimate Team. And once you're back into Ultimate Team, it has the exact same effect on it. Literally the exact same effect as it did on PlayStation. It's incredibly easy. Uh, if you're on wireless connection, I would say this might take you a few seconds to connect back to your router. Uh, as I'm wide, I went straight into it really quickly. Um, so yeah, I'd say if you're on wireless connection, it might take you an extra few seconds just to connect to your router. It depends what kind of router you have. It depends how far away you are from the router. But once you're into Ultimate Team, as you see, we have zero losses on the record still. Uh, and I'll show you guys that Jonathan David has five games played now as opposed to four. Same process. Rinse and repeat 10 times. You get yourself loyalty. Hopefully this video was helpful to you guys. If it was, please smash a like down below and subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here for more Ultimate Team videos. I appreciate all the support on the channel. And I'll see you later.